Yeah. Hi, my name is April and I am the mom of five children, one of which struggles with anxiety and depression. And we actually had a pretty good experience with accessing services in Nevada um, prior to getting insurance. So we had many services available when we didn't have insurance. It was when we obtained insurance that we started struggling. We had to change providers for my child and she had great providers before. Um, we also had struggles finding the providers. Yeah, definitely. So her school was actually really, really, really good after there was an incident there. So um, the, the support was there. She, they had a um, therapist on staff and there was some support there. She got a pressure pass. So if she ever needed to leave class for any reason, she could take that and she could go visit the therapist that was at school. I wish that there was more support before we needed it. Um, just because she's at school for so many hours, it's 35 plus hours a week. It would have been nice to have somebody that would have noticed things because I'm not there. If, it, if there was someone there that could have noticed things going on and maybe saw some things that needed to be addressed, it would have been nice. So that way the incident that ended up happening maybe would have never happened or not been as severe. So um, just having you know staff that's there that is educated and can see the signs of a child that might be struggling, might be getting bullied, or having a hard time, maybe if they seem anxious, they can, you know, go to that child and find out what's going on, ask questions. Um, also, there was, there was a couple incidents at school. There was one where a substitute teacher was involved and it would have been nice if that teacher was prepared and maybe taught how to interact with all students. Um, that you know, this teacher unfortunately um, had an issue with something that my child was doing and decided to, in front of the whole class, ask her if she was gonna have a seizure. And my daughter is on a medication that that is a side effect if you take it. And so she said, well, I could, um, I'm on a medication that could cause seizures. And unfortunately after that, she became known as seizure girl. So. Um, I did approach the dean with this, and I'm very happy with the way he handled it, and um, that was definitely a positive thing. So, like I said, the care and support from the school after incidents was top notch, and I just wish there was some more care and services and maybe some preventative measures that could have been taken before certain incidents.